The superyacht Bayesian was caught in a tornado off the coast of Palermo in the early morning hours and, according to eyewitnesses, sank within minutes. According to reports, one person has died and six others are still missing. A total of 22 people were on board. One of them is the British technology tycoon Mike Lynch. The data shows that the 56-metre yacht was last anchored off Panaria, leaving the area on 15th August at 15.05 UTC. It then passed through the Aeolian Islands, and on 18th August, it reportedly underwent turbulence near Cephalu. The tragedy occurred this morning, according to marine traffic data, while on its way to Palermo. The Bayesian sent its last signal via AIS at 2.06 UTC before sinking. Rescue operations are still ongoing. So far, 15 people have been rescued, including a mother and her one-year-old daughter. Mike Lynch has not yet been found. His wife, Angela Bacares, is among the survivors. The majority of the 22 people on board were from the United Kingdom. But what do we know about the ship? The 56-metre British flagged ship, previously called the Salute, was built in 2008 by Italian shipyard Perini Navi and refitted in 2020. Its 72-metre mast is the world's tallest aluminium mast and the second tallest overall. The yacht can reach a maximum speed of 15 knots and weighs 543 tonnes. The French-designed house Remy Tessier fitted out the Japanese-style interior décor with touches of light, dark beige, dark wood furnishings and a teak deck. It won the Best Exterior Styling at the 2009 World Superyacht Awards and the Best Interior at the 2008 International Superyacht Society Awards. It has six guest bedrooms, one master, three doubles and two twins, accommodating 12 people and another 10 crew members. Pictures show air conditioning units in several bedrooms, which could counter expert claims that open windows may have caused water to rush in and tip the boat over faster. The price to charter the yacht is not stated, but similar vessels are listed at around $170,500 a week. C'erano due barche a vela a distanza da mezzo miglio dal porto, a ridosso con l'ancora a mare. Dopo dieci minuti abbiamo visto un razzo in cielo. Abbiamo aspettato dopo dieci minuti circa l'intensità di questo tornado. E... Storm was over, we noticed that the ship behind us was gone. 